Hey everyone, this is my latest project. It's an FPGA based SKI Combinator Calculus Evaluator. Uh, the whole design is written using Clash, which is a compiler that takes Haskell code and generates a circuit from that Haskell code. So actually almost none of this was written using a traditional HDL, which is pretty interesting. And let me tell you, it's, in my opinion, actually a lot easier to use a Clash for making this sort of thing than it is to use something like VHDL or Verilog. Uh, so basically the way I have this set up is, uh, for demonstration purposes, I've divided the clock frequency by a factor of 8 million. So this is running at about 6.5 hertz right now. Uh, this LED you see blinking, that's actually the clock signal that the evaluator is running on. And it seems to work fine uh, all the way up at 50 megahertz as well, but um, if I ran it that fast you wouldn't be able to see what was happening. So the way this works is whenever the program, the evaluator is running, outputs a character, it gets outputted to this uh, seven segment display. So you'll see the characters kind of slide across. Uh, and this LED next to the clock signal is the halt LED. So when the program terminates, the evaluator will halt and that'll turn on. Uh, and this button is tied to the reset line. So when I push this down, it'll start running. And the program I currently have loaded uh, for the evaluator to run just prints hello world four times and then halts. So I'll go ahead and start running that now. And there we go. So it should uh, output hello world four times and then terminate and there we go it looks like it worked perfect so as you can see uh, this halt LED turned on and now the evaluator is all finished it's just sitting in the idle state so if you want to take a look at this design uh, or play around with it yourself I'll have some links in the description below the video I'll also upload an article to my blog at yager.io and that'll include some info about sort of the underlying design and details about the SKI calculus. And uh, I'll put everything on GitHub so you can play around with it yourself if you want to. And one of the great things about this is that because it's all written using Haskell and Clash, uh, you don't actually need FPGA hardware to play around with this. You can actually just compile the Haskell code to a regular computer program. So you can actually play around with this whole uh, hardware design on a regular computer without needing any special FPGA hardware. Alright, well, that's it. Thanks for watching.